So we put 22 solar panels on about four years ago um, and for 7.37 kW with the idea being that our solar would power our offset our electric bill of our house, which it did almost 80%, which is pretty cool. And then along came the opportunity to add batteries. So we added three power walls and um, we now are using the solar to power to charge the power walls and we have an electric vehicle a tesla model y so the solar comes into the batteries the batteries fuel the electric vehicle and that's what gives us sustainable transportation and then everything is conduited all the way over to our service panel and the Tesla gateway. Each one of these is 13 and a half kilowatt hours of storage, so you have 13 and a half, 13 and a half, 13 and a half for a total of right around 39 kilowatt hours of storage. They are being charged right now in the daylight by the solar panels that are up on the roof, and these are the Tesla power walls. The power wall needs to be inside in the state of Wisconsin, Garages are perfect for it, uninhabitable areas. You can't have them in, in your living room. And so we typically put them in basements and garages. With the Tesla power walls, I have an app that can tell me a, a lot about what's going on with my solar and my batteries. Um, first of all, I can tap on the energy and it tells me that I've produced 24.8 kilowatt hours of power today. And when I go on, when I tap that, it gives me the, my net grid use, which is three kilowatts. Then it shows me my battery charging or, and discharging of the power wall. The power wall discharges at night, charges during the day. So it's a, a constant cycle. Charge the batteries up when you have the sun, sun goes down, don't use the grid, use the batteries and then when the batteries deplete, then you connect back to the grid. Um, it shows me the solar generation today of 27 kilowatt hours so far today. 18.2 um, went to the power wall, 8.7 went to the house, and one tenth of a kilowatt was sent back to the grid. So kind of neat to watch. Um, what else is kind of interesting is when you, are, when you have the app, the app tells you what you're using for power at your house which uh, you never know, you know unless you had something like this to tell you. The other thing it does is it gives me my impact. So right now, in a simple screen, it shows that I have 88% of my day has been self-powered by the sun and by the batteries. 35% by the sun, 53% by the power wall. And I said 88%, so 12% is coming from the grid. And again, that probably came from at night. <clears throat> at night.